Paxton. What? We're not done with the list yet. Paxton. Paxton. Guys. How can you be so sure? You kissed Ben Gross? Paxton asked you out? On top of you moving to India? Wait, what's happening? I know, it's a lot. This is insane. <gasps> Drop your maxi pads. Davey, we're gonna miss you so much. I know, I'm gonna miss you guys too. No candlelit dinner? No rose petals and a little trail leading to the bedroom door? The amount of people that pay attention to you is low. Like, shockingly low. Like you're basically invisible. Yeah, I get a fab, move along. There'll be a billion cocky nerds like Ben at Princeton. This is your one chance to hook up with a Paxton. And when you're old and on your deathbed, whose naked body do you want to be picturing? <laughs> My life is over. <laughs> yeah, I'll see you later. What's a BB Rexa? Oh, is that a robot like BB-8? Oh, honey. Paxton just wants to be friends. Maybe it's for the best. His penis is too big. Yeah, he was wearing gray sweatpants the other day at drop-off. My mom rear-ended a puss. Uh -uh. Ben's penis seems more normal. Now Paxton is someone people can't take their eyes off of. Except when he is with you. Hey. The slideshow's very hurtful. What? No cap, Dave. You trying to ice out my boy? Cancel week of? That's freaking hurtful. Yeah. It was Eleanor's stupid idea to make it all girls. Shame on you, Eleanor. Guys, am I doing something wrong? Yeah. Those earrings are giving me grandma back from a cruise vibes. If we invite enough people, Ben and Paxton won't notice their go through dates. Do you work at the Apple store? Because you're a friggin' genius. Cancel David Chang. We're scrapping the adult soiree. We're throwing a classic sloppy teenage rager. Text everyone you know. Paxton's here. What? Paxton's also here. Oh, shit. What if one of them tries to kiss you alone? What? What do I do? Run away! I don't need comforting. So what? My mom left me to be an extra on the good fight. Who cares? It's not that big of a deal. Do you want me to ask follow-up questions? Or do you just want to anger eat that apple? Apple. We have a problem. Paxton and Ben are both at the fancy wine station. I bet she doesn't have any Indian friends. Neither do you. What? I'm friends with my cousin. Where are all of your Chinese friends, Eleanor? <laughs> I have tons of Chinese friends. Why did we think we could pull this off? Eleanor, push me down the stairs, and then I'll go to the hospital and I'll hide. But then, what if they both try to ride in the ambulance with you? Damn it! Eleanor! Oh, Sharon, what are you doing here? Hi, Mrs. Wong. Hi. We'll see you tonight, Elle. The wolves are in the rabbit hole. Mm -hmm. Huh? Sorry, I thought we chose those code words. Ben and Paxton are both in Davy's bedroom. Mm -hmm. You can't meet my mom. Why? I thought your mom's supportive of your relationship. Yeah, too supportive. She's trying so hard to be an ally, but she keeps saying the wrong thing. Like yesterday. She asked me if I wanted to get a funky lesbian haircut. No, queen. Yeah, that's not great. <gasps> Yo! I drank a whole slurpee on the way over, and I got a waz. Shoes. Oh, yeah. Oh, since my mom is head chaperone, she insisted on making us team shirts. The Jody Bastards. Wow. You weren't kidding. It's so exciting solving a mystery. I feel like the girl with the dragon tattoo, but without the severe bangs. Oh, you don't have to worry. Anissa is way out of Ben's league. Okay, she would never stoop that low. No offense. You really Davy this one up. Are we using Davy as a negative verb? Yeah. You let your temper get the best of you, man. This is worse than when you punch through that vending machine. I didn't pay for those sour straws to get stuck on the coil. No. He doesn't. Never oh. in his life. Who doesn't fart? Ah! Get away from me, pedophile! It's me. Your friend. Davey? From school? Wow, you really look like a pervert. S-O-R-R-Y. She ain't got no alibi. She's sorry. Hey, hey, she's sorry. I don't love the way Malcolm just talked to you.
It reminded me of that health class video we watched about controlling teen relationships. The one from the 80s where the guy smashes the girl's boombox and tells her she can't wear her favorite leg warmers? Yeah, and she cries into her trapper key. I hate being in a fight. How do you deal with people being mad at you all the time? You're not mad at me all the time, right? I promise it's fine. That's literally verbatim what the girl said in the health class video. Last night I was looking at Malcolm's phone and there was a bunch of sus texts popping up. Ew! Who the F is Isabella? The home wrecker he's cheating on Elle with? Huh. So he plays her to her face and behind her back. This dude is trash. Is this an intervention? I don't sniff Sharpies anymore. That was just one tough week. Dude, I am not even bummed that I lost because your closing argument was sick. He was dead before the bullet ever entered his body. Thank you. Damn. I don't know. I mean, thanks, Elle, for bringing all the dresses over, but it's not very utilitarian. Like, where do I put my TI-84? In a drawer at home. Who's this harlot, Isabella? I don't know, but she's no Eleanor Wong. Malcolm sucks, and you deserve someone better. I mean, I don't laugh how many straight girls feel like they can just casually call me bitch now. Amen, bitch. Oh. Forget about Malcolm. I'll be your date to the dance. Now tell me, which essential oil do you need? Sandalwood, please. Hey, stop. Quick question. What would you do if you saw your mom in a car with another man, but it seemed romantic? What? She's cheating on my dad? Oh, no, no, no. Your dad's dead. What? I'm sorry. This is about me. I should have led with that. Makes me think I could easily be sucked into a cult. Oh yeah, we've been saying that about you for years. <laughs> what? Where did that even come from? I was trying something. Forget it. So after he publicly swerved you, he showed up for a sneaky link? That dog. Yeah, he said he'll only be with me in secret. How dare he not treat you like the Tamil goddess you are? You told him to take his toned ass straight to hell, right? Girlfriend, she's the only one. Remember when we were gonna come tonight in a sleek limo with sexy boyfriends? But then here we are. Single at our first high school dance, and we arrived in your stepmom's hatchback. Yeah. I'm really sorry my dress almost suffocated you. It really demands more space than a two-door vehicle. Mm. 